Hello, today I'm in the 3400 block of North Elston. That's like Elston and Roscoe in the Avondale neighborhood in a very large three bedroom, two bathroom apartment. It was rehabbed in the spring of 2020. Here we're in the living room right now. There's a gas fireplace. Above the gas fireplace, you see there's a place for the TV hookup. And then over here on the side, you can see that there is the uh, place where you put input it. So you're not gonna have any wires behind the TV that show. There's where I started it over there. This is a very large living room. If you want to put a uh, large couch in here, you'd have tons of room for it. Under cabinet lighting is very nice. These are big 42 inch cabinets. They're the shaker white. Nice dark pulls like an oil or a bronze pull. There's a garbage disposal. Looking back across at the living room, you can see they have a wine fridge or a uh, fridge for whatever you'd like in it. Looking back where we started, the island has electricity in it, which is very nice. Here you've got your dining room area or your dining room table area. Right off of it, you have a very nice deck. This deck has electricity, it has lights, it also has a hookup for gas, so if you get a gas grill that runs off of natural gas, you could hook it up. You're not going to have to deal with the tanks and running out of stuff. Nice, real wide hallway. Here is the first bedroom. It's got a really big closet. You could fit a queen size bed in here. I want to say they're either nine or ten foot ceilings here. You can see how high the ceiling is above the door. Just kind of give you a reference. It's got recessed lighting, which is very nice. And just by the way it's laid out, you have plenty of room for a queen size bed. Really good size closet in here. Another entrance to it. Here is a linen closet. The second bedroom is about the same size as the first, really good size. You can see it's got the USB outlet. There's several USB outlet charger outlets. Again, again, you've got the high ceilings. There's another closet here. So the closet, there's complete closets between the two bedrooms, so that should kind of help the noise between the two. From here, we'll continue down the hallway. Really uh, nice closet, laundry closet, you've got a side-by-side -side washer and dryer, you have the shelf above it, going down here is the common bathroom, and earlier I had said that there was a linen closet, I think this is the linen closet here, I'm pretty sure it is, and then looking back down there at the one I call the linen closet, it would just be another coat closet as you come in from the outside, if you're coming in from the garage area, that's where you would have the uh, coming up the back stairs there. Really big sink. And again, I said everything was finished in 2020. Spring of 2020 was really nice. Really nice big deep tub. These large tile surround. It's very nice. The rainforest type shower head. The same kind of cabinets that you have in the kitchen. Except here you have instead of the oil rub bronze, you have the chrome. Probably one of the best things about this place is this is the master bedroom, which the best way to describe it is just huge. It'll uh, fit a king size bed, no problem there. You can see it's still got the USB charging outlets in it. Just a really, really big room. It has a balcony off the back. And again, remember you've got that main common, uh, common deck off of the uh, dining area. This face is west. Really big walk-in closet. Get the double closet rods over there. Single closet rods here. Just a very large master suite. Here you've got the stone countertops. 
We've got the chrome pulls, the white shaker cabinets. And this is nice. You have a separate shower. It's got a really nice shower here. Great surround on it that matches the floor. Then you have a whirlpool tub, really big, deep whirlpool tub. Here, so you've got a separate tub and shower. So both of the other bedrooms will fit queen size beds, no problem. And again, this wide hallway is just it gives you a really good feeling. That combined with the fact that you've got these very high ceilings, it's just a very good touch. Central heat and air conditioning, gas forced heat. Again, in the Avondale neighborhood, three bedrooms and two bathrooms.